Oh, it's a, to a kid toothbrush. Yeah. I guess we'll keep that? Yeah. What's the book called? The Life Changing Shop. I know it's very tempting and the my jewelry is beautiful, but please just leave, you can touch it, but please leave it all there, okay? Because we're doing a thing. We read um, this book called The Life Changing Magic of Tidying Up by Mari Kondo. What you do is you take all of the things of a certain kind in your house and you put them all in one place. We went through all of the stuff in our house that is of the sort of medicine cabinet variety. We had things in our pantry and in two medicine cabinets and on a lot of random shelves and it's all here. So now we have to go through it and we have to commune with each of the objects and decide and, and talk to it and listen to it and see if it brings us joy. I'm not going to commune with the Vaseline, honey. Not with the kids here. <laughs> that was dirty. <laughs> and um, and then we decide if it stays Mama, or goes. I have a marble. Mama, I want it. You want that? You don't have a cough, so sadly you can't have that. But I'm glad that you want it when you do have a cough. First things first. It's my answer. 20th century feminine hygiene products. Staying. What kind do you like? I don't really like contact lenses. What kind do you buy? Focus dailies. But really, I can only wear them for like four hours before they start to make my eyes become scratched out. Distilled water, because I had a really like stuffy nose earlier this year and I needed to use a Medi-Pot. I feel like I should keep this because it was expensive. I guess I was having bladder problems. <laughs> and there's this big masking tape label that says not with baby. So it's going to be another year before I touch that. Allergy medicine, more allergy medicine in a different place, same exact kind. That's what we're trying to prevent. Chest rub, lime tincture, nail polish remover. This is like my personal jewelry junk pile. No, I can't go through it this year. I went through it last year. I have two dog sticks. Yes. Yes. Backup and extra backup glasses. Disposable gloves. Yeah. And here's the thing for kids. Snot sucker. Oregano galactone powder. Some sort of dietary supplement. I don't remember what it's for. Can we get rid of it? Well, it's mostly still here. I don't. I don't know what it's for. <gasps> I should probably have a pile of. Call my doctor. Ask her to help me remember why I had this in the first place. Maybe I should start taking it again. I think it had something to do with energy and like cortisol. But it also has to be out of the reach of the kids because they're not kid proof containers. Remember it's up there. Warming vaporous rub. Antifungal foot powder can go. Sunscreen? Neither of our kids would let us near them. Peppermint, oregano, cedar wood, garlic eardrops, kava for numbing your throat. Although neither of our kids have ever had a sore throat. Maybe they will someday. Holy basil, definitely a keeper. That's when I had tinea versicolor on that trip. It was a long time ago. Yeah, get rid of it. Vitamin E, best before July 2016. That makes me think, maybe we should try to give it away. Like maybe some friend of ours is like, oh, I'm dying for good body products, Arnica and Comfrey Joint and Pain Staff. Anyone? Anyone? We have a lot. Mysterious substance, full. Stinky. Boric acid, definitely keeping it. If you ever get a yeast infection, <laughs> once a day for five days, gone. Tiger Bomb? Oh, that's from when I was a kid. I love Tiger Bomb. I didn't, it's not literally from when I was a kid. No, I think. You're done? I think so. Laura was up late, so I'm up with Ivy. This we've yet to go through, and that we're going to. This is stuff we've already put back. Shea butter oil. Old. Needed. Uh, sure. Cold pack. I love Epsom salt. Hollywood fashion tape. I'm gonna go with no. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> Did you sneeze? Yeah. Can I have my glasses? Yeah. 
Thank you. It uh, contains, okay, so we can save this. That's from a hotel that can go. Oh, this is a selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor called Selexa that I've never taken, but when I was really anxious, my doctor gave it to me. And if I continue to not be able to deal with my anxiety with exercise and making video blogs, I will take this and see how it works. If, especially if my family uh, agrees. Um, usually if I'm anxious, uh, other people are a better barometer than my own judgment. Uh, but so far, my, my wife is saying exercise and a little creative act in the morning is working. So we'll keep that as a threat. Go to the gym. Uh, we'll keep that, keep that. I have no idea how ah, full, I guess we keep it. What do you think, should we keep that? Yeah. This is, this is my deodorant all through college. I don't use deodorant anymore. I haven't used deodorant in a long time or any person, but I do take a shower every day and uh, try to get out of the public by four or five or take another shower. So we'll keep it though for emergency. Allergy relief, tenactin, okay. These are from our wedding four or something, four and something years ago. We're gonna keep that, we're gonna keep that. There is a light here, but it's a good light. Something for your eyes. Yes, razor. So we need a new razor. Cause that one's. But I bet we could take all our first aid out and just save the band-aid. You know, I don't use this. Can you put that over there, Ivy? Over, over where we're getting rid of stuff. Keep going, put it on the shelf. Put that on the shelf. We're gonna get rid of this too. I normally buy ocean nasal spray, which is great stuff, especially before you're flying. This is generic and there's not much left. Put that on the shelf, we're getting rid of it. Good when you get sick. Hope we don't need that. Uh, we'll keep that, I guess there's some left. Hey, we can get rid of this, Ivy. Put that on the shelf. How much triple antibiotic does anyone need? Oh, choking hazard. That's my toothpaste. 30 pin Mac cord. Seashells. This was a present. I never ever use it. We're gonna give that to a friend who shaves. We're gonna get rid of that. We got several first aid kits and we're gonna have to make one good first aid kit. What is this? I don't know what that is. That is uh, for getting ticks out. We're gonna keep that. What's this? My tendency with something like this is to put one of these in storage for when this breaks. Laura hates nightlights, but uh, we need them and we'll put that in storage. That's a keeper. Sailing mist for kids. That's for when your winter hands get really dry. Mm, that's from a hotel, we don't need it. I actually use this little Conair uh, nose hair trimmer. I do not know what this is. This goes with the seashells. No idea what that is. Can you put the seashells together? You can play with those. We're gonna put them with the other seashells. This is really good nasal spray, in my opinion. Uh, saline only, non-medicated. Oh my god. Okay, holy. How many bottles? These are extra vitamins. Okay, we'll put that together with the band-aids. I bought that when I when I had a back uh, bulging cervical disc. I bought a lot of things and some of them didn't work and those didn't work. This looks like it's almost done. Only a few more of those. An old earplug, that can go. A battery and a piece of gum. Come on people. We've had this since we've been married. We do like Tom's natural toothpaste. The kids like the strawberry. Getting rid of it. Topical antiseptic iodine. But it's full and dirty, we'll have to clean it. Yep. Benadryl? Yep. Yep. Ivy, we're almost done. Peach Sparkle Body Lotion, give me a break. An almost empty thing of shampoo, we can consolidate. Ooh. Ivy, I found the salt glow from Ojo Caliente out west. I love salt glows. This is our favorite soap. It's just really good soap. Pretty simple ingredients and it works and smells great. I know it's the hippie soap. It's good for camping, by the way, too, because it's biodegradable. The beauty advice is to use this soap and get plenty of sleep. What? Topatch? What's a topatch? Oh, toothbrush. Papa, Papa's not very smart, Ellie Papa. Yeah. 
How many little boxes of stuff does a family need? I just found a box, another thing of box of stuff. Alright, Coles, hydrating something, anti-gas something, Zan pack, garbage, one single an old earplug. That's for glasses, but we'll throw it out. Wow. I think we need a new couple towels. We haven't bought towels in a long time, and we don't usually until we very much need to, and that one needs to go. We need that. We use that. I think we can get rid of that. Ow. My wall shaver clippers, I can consolidate them into one box. I hate these Q-tips. Uh, I have to say, I think Q-tip brand have more cotton. I sound like a commercial, but we've had these 400 Q-tips, and we're down to about, who knows, 50? And when we're done, we're not going to get the generic cheap kind anymore. These are all the scissors from all the clippers I bought. Ivy, we're almost done. We don't ever use a hair dryer, but we might want one. Holy mother of God. I thought I was done. They worked a little in uh, emergency situations. They don't solve any real problems. Travel toothpaste. We're not going to use that. Ivy, I think that's it.